kicked in and this is the Deodora Intrepid OG and to be honest I wasn't even gonna pick this up at first I was gonna skip them um, and the reason why is because I thought they might be a little bit too bland or not special enough because just, this is just white red and gray but to be honest that's the great thing about it it's just white red and gray it's timeless and I saw that the moment I unpacked these and uh, as usual with the Adora, once you have the shoes in hand, the quality is great, craftsmanship is great, on my pair it is great, there are no glue stains whatsoever, the, the leather is nice and plush and there is no misalignment and nothing, just a pure joy to hold these in hand and uh, just great. The thing is, it's, it's timeless colorway, you can wear it to everything, anytime, everywhere and uh, just a great addition in a collection and um, the, the funny thing about the OG here is uh, with, the, with the Intrepid series that it was released in the middle of a couple of colorways and collaborations that have released already uh, for example with the S8000 OG Ristretto and the V7000 OG Ristretto I also think the N9000 they released or they, they kicked off the whole series of colorways and collaborations which is very strange. I'm not. I'm not sure why they didn't do it with this one, but anyways, now it's here. Now it has re-released. This is sub the Roberto Baggio by the famous Italian football player, and it uh, has been released alongside some some track suits and shirts and pants and and whatnot. And um, sizing, um, go with your V7000 size. So that is half up from your N9000 collapse size if you have very wide feet or a high arch go up a full size from your N9000 size um, if you're not familiar with the Odora sizing um, V7000 is about the same size as an A6 GLI 3, GLI 5 or most Nike sizes and uh, the N9000 fits mostly like a New Balance 998, 997. So, half a size up from New Balance, same size as ASICS and Nike. Uh, and if you have very wide feet, adjust accordingly. Um, to me, these are great. Really dig them. I like the model a lot. Um, I, I'm kind of bummed that I missed out on, on the kit one, for example. I really like. I like the Tito always a little bit too colorful. I think it's more of a seasonal shoe and might not last more than one one year um, for my for my taste. Um, yeah, but I, I'm looking forward to to more releases on the model. Um, close up shots are gonna follow and an on feet as well in a separate video, so stay tuned for that one as well. So thanks everyone for watching. If you like my channel, subscribe. If you like this video, hit thumbs up and uh, take that notification bell if you want to get notified if I release a new video. So thanks for watching. Until next time, thanks. Bye-bye.